Hello Mafia City family. Welcome to your own favorite YouTube channel Soul Gaming. To check clan skill and its importance in Mafia City Gold Rush event, we need to go on Council Hall then tap on Council Hall. You will see Council Hall, click on it. Then click on clan here you can see clan skills click on it to open. Now click on plus icon. Here you can see clan active skill. There are currently 4 tier active skill that can be activated by R5 and R4. Each tier features 2 skills, however one skill can be valid at a time. And the previously used skill cooldown time will remain in each tier. Stealth and Anti-Stealth Skill Stealth Operation Activate to become invisible to an enemy when attacking them. The enemy will not be able to view the details of your crew on their battle report. The effect time lasts for 30 minutes, and the cooldown period lasts 12 hours. In latest update they fixed it. Now the battle report will not hide that the crew members kill and loss for battles that occur. When stealth operation effect is effective, anti-stealth recon. While active, if clan members are attacked by an enemy's stealth operation, detail will be displayed in the battle report. The effect time lasts for 15 minutes, and the cooldown period lasts 12 hours. Lethal Demolition and Tactical Mobilization Skill Force Demolition While active, the skill initiator's crew members or raid participants will deal damage equal to 50% of their current durability. When attacking enemy building in the first 4 attack, the effect time lasts for 1 hour, and the cooldown period lasts 24 hours. If a player uses the skill and attack the opponent's lookout tower alone or with others, the first four attacks will cause 50% damage to the lookout tower's durability. For example if the lookout tower has a durability of 50,000, the first attack will reduce it to 25,000 the second attack will reduce it to 12,500 the third attack to 6,250 and the fourth attack to 3,125. It may not help demolish the tower immediately, but it can reduce the durability much quicker. Tactical Mobilization While active, it increases the ops speed of all clan members. The effect time lasts for 30 minutes, and the cooldown period lasts 12 hours. Speedy Conversion and Protection Support Skill Speedy Conversion Demolishes an enemy lookout tower and transform it into an allied lookout tower. The effect time lasts for 30 minutes, and the cooldown period lasts 24 hours. Activate the skill and then attack or raid an opponent's lookout. Once it's occupied by the skill user and the durability has reached zero, the tower will become your own's, with zero durability. Acting in concert with lethal demolition will greatly shorten the time to demolish a tower. Protection Support after activation it increases the defense of all clan members. The effect time lasts for 30 minutes, and the cooldown period lasts 12 hours. Planned Disaster and Fire Support Planned Disaster Send a spy ops team to plant a bomb on a lookout tower when the tower is detonated by the skill initiator or demolished by the enemy. The bomb will explode dealing damage to crew members in the lookout tower area. It won't be possible to build a new lookout tower in the affected area for 8 hours. The cooldown period lasts 24 hours. Use the skill and select a lookout tower, both inactive and active are fine. Select your own lookout tower to plant bombs. Only one bomb can be planted per skill used. And the bomb will be valid in 1 hour. As shown below, there are two types of bomb icons. Manual detonation and destroyed. Manual detonation is activated by the planter. It's only visible to those in the same city and is invisible to enemies. Destroyed is when the durability of the lookout tower reaches zero. Once destroyed the lookout tower will have a skull icon. That can be seen by you and your opponents. The region will be temporarily inaccessible as a result. Fire support. After activation, it increases the crew attack of all clan members. The effect time lasts for 30 minutes and cooldown period lasts 12 hours. 